This is Tokyo, one of the largest mega cities in the world. It has an impressive feats of engineering. So a system of massive structure which is located 72 feet below the city and it has a very special purpose to save Tokyo. Let's talk about this amazing idea. So Tokyo had a problem. Flooding accounts for more than 70% of the total number of the natural and climate-related disasters in Japan. So with more than 100 rivers coursing through the capital region, including four major waterways, Tokyo faced significant flood risks due to the overflow of its numerous rivers for the centuries. So nearly three decades ago, with a cost of 2 billion, the Tokyo began constructing a colossal underground tunnel system which was designed to combat these floods. So which is known as g -Kans project or you can say the Metropolitan Area Outer Underground Discharge Channels. It is a vast network that was built to divert flood waters and it is away from the city's vulnerable. So this system consists of five cylindrical tanks which collect the storm water from the small and mid-sized rivers in the northern Tokyo. So each of these tanks is 70 meter tall which has a capacity to hold 16 million gallons of the water that is big enough to accommodate a space shuttle or the Statue of the Liberty. This system is connected through a 6.3 kilometer long network of underground tunnels. The collected storm water is channeled into a large underground reservoir and chambers that are known as the Floodwater Cathedral. So the engineering behind the underground cathedral is an impressive as its scale. So cathedral's central tank, which is 580 feet long and 260 feet wide, which is designed to handle the vast amount of the water while adjusting the pressure fluctuation. So supported by 59 pillars, each 60 feet tall and weighing 500 tons, this tank's interior resembles a grand suburban temple. So the stored water is eventually discharged into the Iro River, which is capable of managing such volumes of the water. So the entire system can expel up to 7,000 cubic feet of the water per second, which is equivalent to the draining and an Olympic swimming pool just in 12 seconds. So it dramatically reduces the flood risk for surrounding and for communities as well. It went into action during the typhoon in October 2019 when the rainfall in the Nakagawa River basin at the rate of 8.5 inches over 48 hours. So the system diverted some of the 12.18 million cubic meters of the flood water which is equivalent to over 4800 Olympic sized swimming pools as compared to the destruction of similarly powerful typhoon from 1982 this system cut the number of the flooded uh, homes into a river basin by 90% and it reduced and prevented 1.76 billion dollars in related damages. So beyond its functions and its role, Tokyo's approach to flood management combines that once engineering and proactive planning. It also sets the goals by examples. For example, it has a grand scale and architectural design which have done comparisons to religious structures earning in the nickname that is called cathedral. So, so due to its inspiring site and its lowering columns and vast spaces, the facility has also become a tourist attraction which guided tours, allowing visitors to witness the first hand and marvel of this modern engineering and protects one of the world's largest cities. So this was the Tokyo which has the largest mega cities and it is having impressive engineering and the construction project. If you really liked it, then please go ahead and subscribe our channel for interesting videos.